Tonight, new details about a shooting that left 40-year-old Elise Wars and her 4-year-old daughter Corey Ashton dead in the Hagerstown hotel room. Detectives saying as the gunman was standing up, shot both victims in the head as they were lying down. There were no signs of a break-in or struggle. It's unclear if they were asleep. He doesn't have a conscience. Anybody that takes the life of a 4-year-old innocent baby is a monster. Police have since arrested 22-year-old Javon Hines. Several friends of the victim say the suspect was dating wars for just over a month. One of the victim's best friends never even got to meet him. People show you who they want you to see. If he showed her that he was a bad person, she wouldn't have allowed him around her daughter. Court documents show the mother and daughter were last captured alive on hotel surveillance cameras Monday night, two days before officers found their bodies. It says the suspect was carrying the little girl when they walked into the hotel room. Prosecutors say Hines was seen leaving the room 11 hours later, acting suspicious, wearing a mask, and removing items from the room using a luggage cart. She reformatted her whole life around Corey. Everything that she did was for her. In his court appearance Friday, Hines' public defender argues a lack of direct evidence tying him to the shooting. Family, friends and officials are still trying to find out the motive. Tonight, with more questions, come more pain. Ladies, I don't trust these men with your kids. And tonight, we know Hines will stay behind bars. Today, a judge denied his public defender's request to either set a high bond amount or release him to family to be under supervision. He faces multiple charges, including first-degree murder and first-degree assault. In Hagerstown, and Matthew Torres, WUSA 9.